This is going to be something that we're going to be able to use at Camp Razor when we're test driving some pretty rad cars, like some long travel stuff. So no, I'm not going to go into it. And Okay, so check this out. These are so awesome. Look at these stickers. Hello. I got Richard and Sarah here. Hello. And they are with? Signworks. 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 <laughs> and they brought these stickers over. Decals, what do, you, what do we call them officially? These are decals. Decals. Okay. So we brought over some decals and we're putting them on the car right now and we cannot wait to see what they look like. Yeah, these are awesome. We'll come back in a minute as we make some progress. Daddy! Okay, so we're in the garage and hey, Danny's here. Danny Hello. loves to be on camera. So we're in the garage and look at this. That is way cool. So these are kind of just stuck on air right now. Temporary, we're figuring them out. But this is the real deal, look at this. God, it looks so awesome. And who did it? Who did it? It's these people's right here. They came in and installed them for us because they knew, um, they've watched our videos and they know how I do like a lot of this stuff. And I <laughs> messed it all up. So. And for sure I would have messed it up. But so. yeah, and so this June is did Richard. It. Yeah, June, June did, did it. it. She'd do a better you job than I did. manager with us. Yeah. 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 You got this, Dad. You got this, Dad. <laughs> you guys are awesome. So we appreciate it so much. No so, problem. So, Can't wait to see all the videos in Glamis. I wish yeah. we were going. I wish you guys were going to. Next year? Yeah. 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 yeah, for sure. We're we said we go. we're going at least once yeah. next year, no okay. matter what. So. All right, so that's what it looks like, and we love it. Okay, so we're in the car. Danny's helping. And for about the 47,000th time, we're going to pull this console apart. But the reason is because we're doing something cool. Check out this bezel. See that? And like we showed you earlier, this guy right here is awesome but it doesn't quite fit because it hits the bezel right there um and we gotta swap it out for that bezel kind of a pain because there's nuts on the back of these is that true it's true hope so. all right so danny's gonna danny's gonna hold that camera for us pull out our handy dandy stainless steel Buttonhead Allen's buttonhead, yeah. Pull that back. Oh, you know what? I think we can actually pull these back without having to take them. Oh, yeah. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna pull this guy out and put the new bezel on. We didn't even need to take the console loose. Danny doesn't even listen to me. Hey, he almost no. went home because of this. Oh. All these handy dandy little. Stainless steel, button head Allens. I've gotten spoiled. I don't want to turn bolts anymore. I have freaking this. Bam, look at that. Okay, so we're pulling out the last screw right here. Oh, it's so long. Ha. Ah. Anyway. And we're gonna open this guy up. Look at this, Danny. It's pretty cool, right? Yeah. cool is that metals it is all right so we're gonna put this guy on new bezel all right and that's gonna allow this oh we gotta try it out right now look here we go here we go oh uh, that's awesome that's pretty cool right that is all right that is awesome good idea make sure you keep the water out of that radio yeah, it's so cool. All right, so let's put this bezel back in and make sure it's on and make sure it still works. What do you think? Think it's gonna work? I think it'll work. Think it's gonna work? Wow, it's a little tight. Those holes are a little. Okay, so we're gonna put this last screw in real quick. Danny's gonna hold the camera. 
and then we're going to try this out again. All right, we'll come back when we have this tightened up and and we'll show you how it's Okay, so we got it all screwed in there. And new bezel. Oh, look at this. Boom, that's awesome. Hey, right, check this out. Let me see. Wait, let me put it on because I'm gonna be the one that has to do it. All right. Getting ready to wash the car. Are you kidding me? What do you think? I think it's amazing. Do it again. Okay. Should I get a trash bag and some duct tape? No. Done. That's what cool. are you talking about? Cool, I'm right? sorry. If anybody has ever had to be the one that's in charge of covering up the radio before somebody pressure washes your car, then you know why I'm so excited. Wow! Good job. Score. Score rugged. You guys are awesome. Yeah. All right. We'll be right back. We got to put door skins on. We got to get ready for Glamis. We got to. I don't we know. got a lot to do. Crunch time. We got a lot to do. It's crunch time. We'll be right back. Okay, what do you got there, Danny? I have a door bag that we're gonna replace. Okay, here's what we did. These are these are our PRP. P they're our PRP seats. They're not seats. They're door bags. They, seat, yeah. They had these knee pads, right? We cut them off. Here's why. Well, let's go to the other side. So, okay. They had these knee pads, and the knee pads go right up in this area. This is the wrong one, but still. Oh, and, man. And can use knee pads? They go right up in this area, and, and we can't use them. And here's the reason why. There's a door handle right there. So we cut them off. There they go. Danny's going to put this one on. We washed it up a little bit. I didn't do a great job, look. Not really. Not a very good job. That's all right. We don't mind. Sometimes we don't, at the dandy garage, we don't do a great job. Can we do like your mom does? You guys are going to make a lot of editing for me. <laughs> Yeah, right. That's just I just cut out what they just said. You guys didn't hear it. I can't. I can't tell you. They. That was Danny, not me. They. Wait a minute. Is that right? Is that the right side? Is that the right side? Looks like. Let's see. Could that possibly be? Oh, I can tell you by how what stuff's in it. Watch. Here, hold this. <laughs> yeah. No, this is mine. It doesn't fit exactly because these doors are different. The Can-Am, the stock Can-Am doors, have this piece is angled. But we need these bags, especially. Okay, so like Danny, this is this footage is all Danny's fault, by the way, Brian and everybody else. <laughs> Danny instigated this. I'm just gonna say right now. I didn't. But uh, yeah, he did. So anyway, go ahead. While I'm thinking of it, on Facebook, go check out Sand Asylum. Mm -hmm. On Instagram, go check out Sand Asylum. Uh, Brian and April, we like them. It's all funny games. <laughs> but they're crazy. They think they're gonna beat us. I um, Old Hill. Is that why it's called Sand I mean, Asylum? Because it's kind of like for crazy people? Yeah, because yeah. they're nutty, yeah. So, yeah, so, you know, they think they're going to beat us right up that hill just because, you know, that's their spot and we're just little Pismo people. We got sand in the brain and all that stuff. Whatever babbling he was going on about. Salty sand. So Danny's over here. Hello. What's, he, what, what's Danny doing? Trying to get these doors put back together so we get this car ready for Glamis. So, I can't tell you how awesome this is. I learned a new trick today. Right. Brandy has known this trick for many years. I That's that. hold the camera while other people do the work. Nick Lenard, if you're watching, you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> right? So. You know what? Me and Nick, smart. I know that. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not dogging. I just thought it was a funny joke. Dogging? It's actually. Are you talking about my shoes? Yeah. <laughs> I'm dogging. Yeah. It's just the smart thing to do. Just to hold the camera. It's the smart thing to do. I do a lot of this. It's not like I'm done doing this. Danny's not gonna He's come over here. He's just taking a break. Yeah. Danny's not gonna come over here and do everything for us. No. Right, that was just like a. He's just helping help, out. He's helping out. You're doing a good job. He's, he's helping Glamis prep. Camp Razor prep. Nice. Look at those doors. So we got Velcro straps. We talked about that. We need the we need these door bags, Brian, for all the cameras and stuff so we can capture this event. So we can take some tissues in here and stuff. Mm -hmm. Lots of tissues. Um, I don't know, some 
some warm hugs or something in so that we can store in the bags. And the Velcro sticks up over the door a little bit. That's just what we're stuck with for now. We'll figure it out, you know, we'll figure it out later, but we're out of time. So that's what we're doing. We're going to put this one on now. Here we go. Door skin number two. Not four scan, door scan. We'll be right back. So this whole thing where uh, I hold the camera and other people like turn bolts and stuff, that's awesome. I like it a lot, <laughs> not gonna lie. So check that out. That's what's going on right now. Brandy's, look at this. Brandy's doing this. I'm doing lots of art. Yep. She's well, doing- see, I don't actually mind because when this we is how art is for this. put mine together over here, you're doing all the bolt turning. Look at this, I did quite, the art is for. I did quite a bit. So, but that was a, but that's a long time ago. I mean, what? So Brandy is doing the graphic arts. Look at right here. Uh, it's all going down. R Z R bam. Camp R Z R. Look at that right there. Upside down. Upside down. Yeah, that's beautiful, right? That is. That's awesome. And Danny's finishing, Danny's, Danny's finishing up the door. The car is pretty shiny. I did the shiny part. I made it shiny. It's still, we still gotta wipe it down. It's not completely shiny. But the first stages of shininess have been applied. And we'll apply some more shininess. And uh, yeah. Tomorrow, tomorrow, which might be in this video. So it won't, it'll be like all one day for me. We'll be, uh, I'll probably be back tomorrow. Yeah. Door stickers. Oh, yeah, yeah. Door stickers. Lots of door stickers. And he might come and help us again. So, if tomorrow is in today's video, it will be today's video tomorrow. You know what I mean. Somebody knows what I mean. Okay, so, new door skins are on. We explained why. UPS. Uh, door bags are in, like we just said. I think we're ready to go other than stickers. I mean, we got a little bit more shine up to do, but other than some more shine, I'm not too sure about this uh, dollar store uh, furniture polish because it seems like it's taking multiple applications for the real stuff. So we'll revisit that. Is we it? might try it. We'll see what happens. I'm not sure yet. Look, we have batteries. Nice. Ooh, what could those be for? Well, we have also some type of a uh, a cable yeah a cable a cable another type of cable nice nice connector and whatnot oh my god it just keeps uh, some getting more this is like extension cables um lots of cables lots they're everywhere and dun, da, 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 the piece de resistance is this right here ready I don't know. In my head, that sounds different than it probably comes across. Okay. Maybe, huh? This is an RP242. It's a portable two place intercom. Reason Boom, being, that. guys, that is so cool. okay. with the audio extender to allow us to um, continue to record from our cameras or our phones or whatever we're using into hook up to the intercom in whatever car we're riding well actually this is a portable intercom so when they don't have communications we take this system with us if you guys have been subscribers of our channel then you'll realize that a few months ago we were in glamis last season actually and we did a test drive in a, an mts off-road car at their their event that they had down there at the bottom of olds and we couldn't really um we couldn't really show you our true feelings about how awesome that car was at like over 200 horsepower to the to the wheels like 240 or something. 240 like hitting 70 miles an hour almost backing off at the top of olds i can't even go into it but this this time we're going to do that again but it's going to be even more awesomer um and we couldn't tell you you could see my facial expressions and stuff but it's not the same as me being able to talk because i'm hilarious you'll be able to hear me now because yeah, this is awesome they hooked us up with a portable one that we can take with us in any car that we're in any test drive that we go on, we can hook this up to our our helmets, and um, we can tell you guys while it's happening how amazing it is or how bad it sucks. Yep. So here's the way it works. It's it's really something that's really cool about it. So it can actually. Oh man. Oh my god. Hold this camera for me. Yeah. Stay. Uh, oh man. 
Hold on. We'll be right back. Hold on. Hold, Hold on. up. Wait a minute. Let him get some. I got a screwdriver. This thing's tight. Okay. So tight. here's what's really cool is. She's not. Go on. So what we got to do here is. Okay. Open this box up and we'll show you what, what's going on here. Okay. So here in this bag, there's a really cool couple of things. One is this guy, right? Right. So if your car has a cigarette lighter or whatever car we're going to test drive. We don't call it a cigarette lighter anymore. We call it a 12 I'm volt sorry, um, connector. A 12 volt receptacle. Yeah. If your car has 12 volts, you can connect this guy into here. Two 9 volt batteries, right? Yeah, that's crazy. Where'd they go? I give them to you. Oh, they're, they're right there. Those are Amazon batteries? Yes. Amazonian. So we're going to smack these in there. This just looks cool. I feel like I'm part of a secret. Um, if anybody ever watched the show Lost, when you're like, beep, boop, bop, bop, beep, with the numbers, that's what I feel like. Like, yeah. I have access to the, um, you know. All right. So this is this is really cool because what you're able to do is put some batteries in this. Oh, man, there's plastic on these. Does it ever end? You have a lot of work, hard work. Yeah. Good thing Danny's here. Hey, Danny, when do you have to leave? He's not leaving. Right now? No. <laughs> Danny. Huh. Don't be crazy. Oh, you don't have to leave. You already sold your paddles. You got all day. Yeah. So I'm just kind of winging it here. I don't know what's the best way to put this in. Oh, like that. Yeah, Boom. I'll figure it out. Look at that. Nice. Okay. There's that. Okay. Here's this one. Mm -hmm. Don't you dare think about leaving, Danny. We got work to do. That goes together like that. That's Put... not me. Yeah. So that all goes together like that somehow. Like so. Mm -hmm. We're gonna call this good. I think it's great, actually. All right. Yeah. So, okay. So what we got we're... here? This is the audio cable. This is key for us because this is what we use to record in the camera that we're talking to right now through our helmets. So what happens, we connect our helmets to our intercom, we connect this cord to record, I'm assuming we plug this into the camera, boom, then we can record. Uh, if we want to connect at, like say a radio, any kind of radio, a handheld, whatever, mm -hmm. there's a place for that right here. Here's co-driver, driver, that's these cables. So what'll happen here is, let's see, how does this work? Okay, yeah, so these plug into this, ching, ching. Then your helmets could plug in here, but this is kind of short here. So here's an extension. Okay. Right? This yeah. is, and that has clean up a lot of a, make less of a mess. Clean up the garage, cause you know. And I'll look up, we'll talk about these again in a minute. Right. So that's what we have. Awesome. Thank you, Rugged, for making this happen because this is gonna help us. And I think Rugged might, at some point, they might have a car that we're gonna check out. This I, I think plugs into the radio, that cable. So we have everything we need to have a complete intercom radio system right here, portable. You guys awesome. are awesome. We've been talking about this for a little while, like how we yeah. were going to do it, and racking you guys made brains. it happen. Yeah, I was like, I'm researching, racking my brain, trying to think about, you know, we have some PCI right here. I was like, maybe I can uh, take that, in, uh, you know, all this stuff, I can wire it. And, and I mentioned that to Rugged, and they're like, oh, just, you know, here's the box, and it's, there's everything, we are done. Yeah. Push and so talk. if you oh, guys push to talk. Push push to talk. talk. So if you guys want to have the same type of deal, because we're not the only ones that want to go out and try other cars. We're not the only ones that want to go out and have some type of a portable system. If you're riding in your friend's car and you want to be able to still have communications if they don't have a radio, then we will put all the part numbers below for the stuff that we got. Um, so that way you guys know what you need so that you can always be safe. I have an idea to go along with that. What? Like, you know, there's channels out there. There's side by side blogs blogs True. side by side blog they could use some they're always trying out different cars they could totally use this they have 10 they're bringing 10 cars i watch their videos in case you know. i watch them too sometimes and, yeah we, we like them even though, even though you know we like them even though they're clear in michigan we still but, like them so but they could probably use this so okay so check these out these are pretty cool somebody gave these to brandy they're to go on oem doors they don't fit our doors but at some point, when we get a chance, we're going to try these out on Danny's car. What do you think, Danny? Perfect. I'm willing. 
I think they're awesome. They feel really, really beefy. And thank you, Jeremy from Iron Panther Trailers. Like you're awesome. He fabricated these himself for his 2017 X3, which he has an Iron Man edition. He's done a little bit of racing, so much appreciated. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Um, leave us a comment. We love talking to you. Can't wait to see a bunch of you at Camp Razor. It's going to be overwhelming to me. I feel overwhelmed already. I'm not even there. Um, please give us a thumbs up if you like the video. If you don't, like hit it the, the you know the dislike two times so I know that you hate it. Um, and let us talk to you. Join our Facebook group, Dandy Off Road Adventure Seekers. I'll put a link below. That way you guys can share your adventures with us and that's where we post all of the awesome stuff that we're going to be doing which is like ongoing we're just starting right now it's it's like opening season and if you guys want to um be invited to the event that we're going to be participating in with uh sand asylum brian myers and if you want to how you get to that event is you go to our facebook group which is dandy off-road adventure seekers there's going to be a link below i'll actually put a link below to the event that i'm creating so that way if you guys want to uh show up let us know um, we'd love to know that you're going to be there and you are more than welcome to share out that event and invite your friends because the more the merrier. Um, we're also going to be doing another event in Glamis just a hangout session at Boardmanville with the queen of Glamis, Courtney, and uh, she's been super gracious and she's friends with Brian um, and uh, it's going to be a great time. I'm super duper excited, so stoked. I can't wait to be there. I'm like on countdown mode, so. Yeah. Okay. Right? Awesome. Right? Peace. Peace. All right, bye. Peace, Danny. Peace. There we go.